Welcome to the Crypto Market Minute. I'm Doug. Let's get to the charts. Well, today we're going to start with Bitcoin's weekly chart to give us some perspective here. So as you can see, we've been in this downtrend. We came down. This was our um, big sell-off that we had. We tried to put in a bounce, which was nice, but we have retraced all that and broken through here and now through those bottoms. So we have to look at the bigger picture to kind of get an idea of what is where we are likely to go. And as you can see here right now, we're sitting at about 23.6. And it looks like there's maybe a little area of support right here around the 20,000, 19,000, 20,000 mark. Uh, and that's really the only place that I, I see any kind of support at. And it's not a lot of support. It's just this little, little blip right here, these little few overlapping bars. But that should be our next logical target here of about 20,000. Uh, to $19,000. Let's look at Ethereum. Ethereum has been the weaker of the charts. We didn't even hardly get a bounce at all here where Bitcoin and the, some of the other markets did bounce. Uh, and we have just kind of continued straight down here. We're already in this kind of sloppy support area. It goes from about 900 up here to about 1200 in these sloppy overlapping bars. And that's kind of where we're getting into now. So Ethereum may get down here and try to hold between this 900 area and the 1200 area where it's at right now. Let's look at Card Cardano. Like Ethereum, Cardano has some support here between this, around this 30 to 40 cent area here, which is kind of where we are just above now. Uh, we came down and hit that uh, 40 area here with the big sell off several weeks ago. Uh, Cardano bounced more than the other markets did, which was very po uh, positive, very bullish. But we have retraced that and are back down here toward these lows. So we should find some support in this overlap here between 30 and 40 cents. Well, that's all for this morning. As always, remember to like and subscribe. And of course, if you have questions, leave them in the comments below and we'll get back with you as soon as we can. We'll see you back here on The Grasp. Okay.